when the boss says they are working on it, sounds like we have a solid confirmation that Mini is finally going to build a production version of the Super Legra concept. The Mini Super Legra concept was arguably one of the most successful design exercises of the brand when it debuted back in 2014 but since then we didn't have a clear answer on when and if the concept will reach production. Speaking to Autocar, Mini boss Peter Schwarzenbauer said, the interest was tremendous when we showed this concept car. We are now working hard to get it on the street. It's an economically challenging project and there is no firm decision, but we have a lot of people here that are fighting for it. I think it would be extremely good for the brand. Not quite 100% then, but the story goes on saying that they have decided to use the same platform with the three-door Mini due to its versatility, low weight and rigidity which makes it suitable for use on an open top model. That means that the Super Legra will be forward with the possibility of an all-wheel drive setup for the more punchy versions. Schwarzenbauer sees it as a clean start and not as the successor of the Coupe and Roadster models. They don't compare. The Super Legra is a serious sports car, he said. The production version of the Super Legra will use the same engine range with the mini hatchback, meaning a lineup between 1.5 to 2.0 liters and perhaps a new hybrid system which will debut in the BMW 2 Series Active Tourer, combining a 3-cylinder 134 HP 1.5 liter turbocharged and a rear-mounted 87 HP electric motor, producing a total of 216 horsepower. Mini is currently developing the next Countryman which will be the first to use this hybrid powertrain, with the Super Legra to follow in 2019 according to the same info.